So, for those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Frank Juan. I'm a 25-year-old Sichongu Lakota from the Rosebud Reservation. And this is a special night for me. This is the first time I've got to perform in the Black Hills. Not, not only that, but there's a lot of people from home I grew up with. There's a lot of kids from home. There's a lot of artists who I looked up to and who were like mentors to me, who shared this stage here with me tonight. It's very beautiful. And this next song I'm gonna do is a testament to all that. So this song I'm gonna do is called Oil for Blood. So the group that just came on before me, Ulale, I sampled them in this song. Way before I knew them, way before I knew I was gonna do this, I was just sitting there and I was, I'm a fan of theirs. Pure Faye and Jen, you know, I looked up to them, so I sampled this song. And it's just very beautiful that I get to share a stage with them and they sang that song before I came on and now I'm gonna do this song. But this song, Oil for Blood, is inspired by an elder from one of our communities here. And um, I, I heard earlier that she was here, so I don't know if she's still here, but I want to acknowledge her. And uh, her name is Marie Randall. And uh, I don't know, well, you guys are probably all aware, you know, we've been fighting the Keystone XL pipeline for a while now. They're trying to build it through our home back home on the Rosewood Res. We've been resisting for a good number of years. There's people who are here right now who are living out at our spirit camp. There's a spirit camp set up on the route of the pipeline. And these people sacrifice their time, their energy, their money, their life, their families to be out on that site to protect our homeland. Because this isn't about gas prices, this isn't about money, this isn't about an economy for us, this is about land and water because they're building that through the Oglala Aquifer, which is where we get our fresh water supply. So when this pipeline leaks, not if, when, it will destroy our fresh water supply. So we are human beings. Native people are human beings just like everyone else. We deserve water just like everyone else. It doesn't matter who you are. So I want you all to make some noise for the people who are here from that spirit camp tonight. Those people who are on the front lines and lives and families are at risk. Our people, my people. So Marie Randall inspired this song. There was a protest happening like three or four years back. Back home they blockaded a road. They stopped trucks carrying pieces of the pipeline from coming on. And a video came out of this elder named Marie speaking to my generation and she was saying, grandchildren, all we have left is our land and our water. We need to protect this. We need to protect each other. You're Lakota. Stand up for your rights. I'm 92 years old. I'm out here on the front lines. When I die, who's going to take over? And that really struck a chord with me. It got me thinking about my responsibility in all of this. And it inspired this song. So if Marie's here, I want you all to make some noise for Marie Randall. Oil for blood, oil for blood. My mother is green, that oil is blood. 
battles that we're facing with natural energy extraction. Make some noise for all those people back home on the front line. 